in this question, we have to determine which of these transformations that are shown here is correct. Well, let's start with the first one, which is a translation. Translation refers to the movement of a shape or object about a grid. So if we were to take, for example, this shape of the house here and move it around, let's see if it matches up anywhere on our grid. So as we move it around, we're translating it, and you notice that the shape doesn't change in any way. So if I try to move it over to the other shape that's shown, we can see it doesn't match up. Therefore, this is not a translation. Okay, let's try our other translation, which would be down here. I'll just move this object down there, and it matches up there. So again, a translation means move the shape or object around without changing its orientation to see if it matches up. Well, if I try to put it over here, we can see it doesn't match up. Therefore, this is not a translation. Okay, let's try the reflection. So here, reflection means if I flip the object about an axis, so the axis here would be this vertical line here, it should um, match up. If it doesn't match up, then it's not a reflection. So let's give it a try. Okay, let's flip it over and see what happens. You can see that it doesn't match up, so therefore this is not a reflection. Okay, let's try our last transformation here. And I'm going to flip it back to where it was. And we can see it matches up there. So a rotation means to turn the object about a specific point. And in our case, we're going to use this point right there, the corner of the house, to turn the object to see if it matches up. Okay, let's give it a try. If we were to turn the object about that specific point to see what would happen, does it match up? And as we can see, it does match up. Therefore, this is a rotation. And so this transformation matches its title. It is a rotation.